Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. I'm Wild Sparrow and welcome back to TNA. This is episode 48, my longest running series on the channel so far of anything ever in the history of any series of any game. Um, it's pretty ridiculous, but before I get into the booking, and I know last episode I spent like 9 minutes or 10 minutes uh, just going over the screen and feuds and things and thinking out loud and I'm sorry about that but sometimes I have to force myself to think out loud so I can have some ideas um, but there's an actual good reason why I'm not moving into booking yet uh, it's because I want to tell you guys about what's going down for the next episodes now this is episode 48 I'm gonna book an impact just like any other episode um, we're gonna uh, book impact but we're not gonna end the month as you can see we are uh, reaching the end of the month but we're not gonna end it on this episode instead what I'm gonna do so that episode 50 can be something special uh, episode 49 we will end the month of June we will look into the month of July we will schedule our July pay-per-view or large event or whatever you want to call it and we will in episode 50 Book an entire month. July will be an entire month. Uh, well, obviously July will be an entire month. Uh, July, the entire month of July, what I meant to say is that it will be booked in one episode. So that means, uh, you know, months have roughly four weeks, five maybe. So that will be four explosions, four impacts, and one pay-per-view all in one episode. So that will be roughly uh, f uh, 10 to 15 minutes for each show. So that means 15, 30, 45, one hour for explosion, one hour for impact, and 15 minutes. So if I do 15 minute uh, booking screens, uh, if I'm not faster than that, it'll take up to two hours and 15 minutes. But before I do that, I want to make sure that you guys are okay with it, if you agree with it. Because if not, I can do like one week or two weeks or you no, know, just just do something. Because I want to do something special for episode 15. I think that a special one month booking is exactly what an episode 15 needs, right? So let me, let me know you guys in the comments, you know, the usual. And even some people who watch the series that don't comment because I know... A few episodes uh, episodes of this have blown up, uh, you know, just uh, episode 25 and 45 are really big, like 45 uh, within a few days, two days actually, from the recording of this has reached 375 views as of this recording, so that's pretty ridiculous. Um, so yeah, if you guys would like to see that, let me know, because episode 50 will be a special one. Uh, I might stream it, I might stream it and then, and then make it a VOD. Cause that'd be pretty neat, you know. So I could stream and interact with you guys, and and uh, it'd be a, a pretty cool special. But otherwise, I'll, I can just record, and I can just record two weeks or three weeks. But I'd like to do one month. So you guys, let me know what you'd like to see. And without further ado, let's get into booking impact. I made a few changes. Just gonna show you guys that um, Shelton Benjamin will be turning heel. Uh, on impact so we can even out the score uh, Rim Mysterio has been sent over to explosion uh, and Jushin Liger will be turning heel as well so this means that our next feud for the TNA World Heavyweight Championship could be could be Cody Rhodes versus Shelton Benjamin because he's now a heel well he will be as of tonight so let's get into booking uh, exactly that. As you can see, turns. We have Shelton Benjamin set to turn. We have no debut set. So let's get into this. Uh, we're gonna open the show. So you know how uh, CM Punk close explosion. Well, The Rock's gonna open Impact. He's gonna cut uh, a promo. Not I meant to do uh, an interview. There we go. Uh, single worker with The Rock on nobody he's gonna be like CM Punk put one hell of a fight up uh, but you know the better man won and the better man just so happened to be me uh, and I know how I wanna end the show I wanna end the show with a shock turn of um, of Sheldon Benjamin it won't be so much of a shock as um, people realize 
why he did what he did because Sheldon Benjamin will be aligning himself with Kurt Angle. So Sheldon and Angle are reuniting and it feels so good. Um, uh, match 1v1, singles, uh, Cody Rhodes versus Kurt Angle uh, for the World Heavy Championship. Cody retains once more. Uh, the finish is Cody Rhodes uh, cleanly, but the aftermath is a run-in attack on Cody by Shelton. The purpose would be to um, build up to a future match. So that's, that's that, because I don't want to put two turning angles, because then... Um, he might end up as a tweener accidentally and I don't want to do that because that's happened to me before I've had two turning angles in one show for the same person and that person I ended up as a tweener by the end of the night so that kind of confused me uh, so impact we're also going to end the Adam Cole vs. Eric Marius feud um, Tanahashi and Okada also have to end their feud um, yeah um so we're going to book Lashley and Chris Hero versus Brother Devon and Brother Ray as well. But first, um, Angle, Other Angle, Celebration for Eric Marius. And you might be wondering why he's celebrating. Well, here's what he's celebrating is because he has just beaten Adam Cole for the Grand Championship. There we go. Eric Marius wins by cleanly. The aftermath is nothing. The purpose is to end the feud. There you go, and that ends the feud. Eric Marius is the new TNA Grand Champion, which is great. Um, I feel like this feud isn't quite ready to end yet. Uh, I was right. Um, so we're going to have a tag team match. Uh, it's going to be... Tag team match, there we go. Uh, Kazuchika Okada and Matt Jackson taking on Hiroshi Tanahashi and Chris Hero the team known as Chris Hiroshi Tanahashi nailed it Hiroshi 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 nailed it Hiroshi Shiro oh that's just silly that's my Bali Shiro and Hiro um, and that'll give the win to to Tanahashi, no, to Okada, my bad. I was selecting Tanahashi, so I said Tanahashi. Uh, by cheating. Uh, the aftermath is a brawl to the back. These guys can't get their hands off each other, continue the feud. That unfortunately means that um, Hero and Lashley are not going to team up. Uh, but it does, uh, however, mean that Lashley will take on Brother Ray. Uh, Lashley will take on Brother Ray. Whoa. Lashley versus Brother Ray. There we go. Um, for no championship. What am I doing? Uh, Brother Lashley wins. <laughs> Cleanly. The aftermath. Uh, Lashley celebrates. It's like purpose. Um, put Lashley over. Uh, okay, so that's that. And now the tag team feud. Um, I believe singles matches also count for feuds. So we are going to have a singles match. And that singles match will be Tommaso Ciampa versus Joe Hennig. Uh, for no championship, with Joe Henny getting getting the uh, the win by cheating. Uh, no aftermath. The purpose is to continue the feud. There we go. 
and before that we have um, an angle an ambush angle a 2v1 backstage ambush angle where Joe and Bo attack um, Eric uh, Young so that UI can come out to be with his partner and help him win or help uh, even the odds not help him win because they're faces so they shouldn't cheat unless they're Eddie Guerrero which they obviously aren't um, what else can I do who do I want to elevate if anyone I don't see anyone that I want to elevate um, necessarily so what we're gonna do is we are going to have um, brother Devon uh, taking on Ted DiBiase so as you can see the tag teams have, uh, have been split up a bit so they're not you know just wrestling tag team matches uh, versus uh, Ted DiBiase there we go for no championship with uh, with uh, Ted DiBiase getting the uh, the win cleanly no aftermath the purpose put Ted DiBiase over um, I don't think there's anyone in the main event that I didn't use um, Hero, Rhodes, Tanahashi, Lashley, Benjamin, Cole, Okada, Angle uh, but I do want to have an interview with uh, with uh, the champion Cody Rhodes who weighs in on Slamiversary and says that he's ready for any challenger uh, that comes from anywhere in the world so that sets up Kurt Angle saying you're ready for anybody fight me again then you'll be ready for anybody and then Sheldon's like I'm anybody I can fight him too so they double team Cody Rhodes later on in the night so we have a 95% for the Rocks interview an 84 for the uh, for Cody Rhodes interview I was gonna say the Cody's uh, Teddy Biasi gains over this from beating uh, Brother Devon in a 72% overall rating a 71 and over and uh, an overness gain for all three men involved in the angle uh, 76 for Hennig cheating to bit, uh, beat Chiampa. Uh, Lashley gets a 76 for beating Brother Ray. Uh, an 88 for Okada and Jackson versus Tanahashi and Hiro. Um, an 82 for Eric Marius finally um, beating Adam Cole. Adam Cole gaining overness and losing overness in the same match. Eric Marius just gaining overness. Uh, finally, Eric Marius wins the the big match. He gets the TNA Grand Championship. Uh, it's a feel good moment for him. Uh, Ninety percent overall rating for Cody Rhodes' Kurt Angle, and an eighty four for Sheldon Benjamin's turn. He turns heel and gains overness from his turn. An eighty rating for Impact, which is great. It's really great. So let's finish this up. Uh oh. Well, there's an incident. So let's handle that. Harry Smith, he he didn't even wrestle. He did not even wrestle. What the hell? Okay, let's medical. How long? Oh, pfft, he'll be back tomorrow. Anyway, that'll do it for this video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. Let me know what you think in the comments. Subscribe if you want to see more, and I will see you in whatever I upload next. Bye!